Next Day at CSMA begins the same way that it has begun for the past 25 years. He dashes in the door, up the stairs, and is immediately immersed in administering a school with the mind of a musician. When Nick arrived in 1985, there were 95 students and 18 faculty. Now, with 850 students and 100 faculty, it's still the same drill. Sit, talk, run, dash from office to music studio, from phone conversation to paperwork. He accomplishes his job using techniques known only to him and utterly mysterious to anyone else. Nick's genius is that he doesn't just teach you to play, he teaches you how to make music out of music, not just to play nice notes. He has a kinship with the music that he gives to you. He teaches you to reach into the soul of the music and bring out its beauty. He always tells me a funny story and I pretty much laugh through my lessons, but the stories relate to the music and the composer, so I learn from them. He's kind of like Santa Claus with the stories. When I take my lesson, I'm always hoping to get the Nick look. He glances at my mother with raised eyebrows. That means I did a good job. He always speaks his mind. He's never too soft, but he's also a peacemaker talking things through to a solution. He's a cross between an ombudsman and King Solomon. He's got eight brains and they're all going at once. You never know which brain you're going to talk to and that's why you get much more out of every interaction than you ever expected. There's no such thing as a simple conversation with Nick. Learning from Nick is like having a wonderful conversation. He is a gentle teacher with very high standards. He sees my bad habits but he doesn't hound me about them. And in the midst of my lesson, that wry British humor always comes out. Nick has an extraordinary heart in the place where most have egos. Nick's vision for CSMA has always been about the music and the art, what's best for the students and the school. Whether building programs, the concert series, or his stellar faculty, Nick has remained true to himself, teaching and inspiring that inside spot in all of us. We wanted the girls to learn to play the piano. Nick's turning them into real musicians. What can be better than that? Nick makes a personal connection with everyone, and all feel his touch. He has created a sense of home for each student and family at the school. Mm